Hello, Leo, my awesome lions and lionesses. I missed you. Hope you had a beautiful, relaxing weekend. Leo, you want a soulmate reading to check up on the latest energies between you and your soulmate. First, as usual, we're going to ask what's coming up for you, what you'll be dealing with, facing in your life, and how you're currently doing on your soulmate journey. Second part of this video, we're going to ask about your soulmate. Whoever it is you're thinking of, concentrating on while watching this video, whether you're currently in contact with them or not. First, we're going to ask how this person is doing at this time and how they are currently relating to you emotionally what's on their mind what they thinking feeling at this time especially in relation to you leo universe please step in show very clear and important messages for the sign of leo for leo's highest good please universe please show us what's coming up for leo in their life and how is leo currently doing on their soulmate journey what's coming up for leo in their life and how is leo currently doing on their soulmate journey. Let's see, Leo, what's popping? One extra message, very important. Ooh, Archangel Michael is popping up here for you already. You are protected. Yeah, this is you being protected. Wow, this, if you've been feeling sick or low on energy or depressed, or ill in some way. This is you uh, needing to take a step back from certain people in your life, certain situations, certain relationships that have been draining you. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. You need a long time. And, uh, there may be someone in your life that you are close to emotionally um, that may be going through drama or uh, something challenging. Uh, you're going to have to let them go through it because they're learning their karmic lessons through those challenges. Yeah, you can't worry about things that are beyond your control, that are someone else's lessons, karmic lessons. Yeah, you're going to have to accept the fact that we all have to learn from our own experiences. We cannot learn from other people's experiences. It's impossible. Oh, many of us try to say, oh yeah, I wanna learn from somebody else's mistakes. There's no such thing. We have to make our own mistakes to learn important life lessons. So this is you needing to realize something about a situation in your life where you need to step back and let the person you care about, whoever they may be, whether it's a friend or family member, uh, to let them learn their lessons, uh, balance their own karma, okay? Very important that we understand that, that we can't just fix people's lives for them. That's not possible. We can't fix it because even if we could fix it, they wouldn't learn the lessons that they need to learn from the challenges they're facing. Beautiful, you have good karma, Leo. Yeah, you do. You've done good deeds for others. It's coming back to your first circle in the form of blessings, opportunities, ideas, worthwhile friendships. Beautiful. A lot of you are dealing with the soulmate that's a Leo, also Pisces, also Virgo and Sagis. Universe, please show us what's coming up for Leo and how is Leo currently doing on their soulmate journey? Yeah, so this is you holding on to some kind of situation that you want to fix, but it's not meant for you to fix it, okay? Oh, your soulmate, this is how you view your soulmate. Uh, uh, very uh, proud and set in their ways, not communicating with you effectively. Uh, yeah, not expressing emotions. Yeah, you have a lot of... Uh, drama in the family, it looks like. Who doesn't, right? We all have drama in the family. But it looks like you have more drama than most families for some reason. Like a bunch of people in the family arguing, bickering. Uh, one person in particular finds you threatening, meaning they're intimidated by you. They feel very insecure. Um, but this may be someone... Uh, who is not your blood relative, but someone 
that's your relative through marriage yeah that finds you threatening that finds you mm, intimidating to them your your sheer presence uh, they find intimidating so obviously they must feel guilty about something they're doing because they view you as very strong perceptive wow you have a lot of love around you so you have a lot of people that love you leo that care for you yeah you see very clearly who you can trust who you cannot trust yeah you stop putting work into your soulmate relationship you're not putting work into it anymore yeah this is you feeling unloved unreciprocated you see two of cups is empty there's no fluid in the there's no liquid in the cups empty cups yeah this is you feeling unappreciated by a lot of people you feel like you need to stay away from certain people and you do because there's a bunch of people around you that will drain you if you let them yeah let's do this universe please show us what's coming up for leo how is fabulous leo doing universe yeah you see this is you letting go of toxicity from your life toxic people toxic situations toxic relationships so it looks like the soulmate you letting go of that just showed up a minute ago as emperor did you wrong you see the devil showing up here whether they cheated lied about something major put your life on hold whatever they did was serious yeah new soulmate popping up here for you i love it new soulmate one of my favorite kings king of wands someone attractive mature independent the person that you're letting go of that you let go of uh is very worried but this show, this combination shows me addictive behaviors like something they can't control uh, addictions addiction to certain behavior that is sabotaging their relationships with other people something they need to admit to themselves and work on yeah mm, this is heavy for them i love the new soulmates energy yeah your energy is beautiful leo my favorite queen of all queens queen of pentacles whether you're male or female you could be either gender and hold this beautiful highly vibrational energy this is gorgeous. This is you being independent, strong-willed, taking care of yourself, not needing anyone to take care of you. You have a lot to offer in a relationship. You are grounded. Yeah, you are loving. You are nurturing. Yeah, I love this. Let's see what's going on with this soulmate of yours. And in the extended, we're going to ask about both of them. Universe, please show us what's going on currently with the soulmate of Leo that Leo is letting go of for now. And how is that soulmate of Leo towards Leo at this time? Especially emotionally. What's going on currently with that soulmate of Leo? And how is that soulmate of Leo towards Leo at this time? Especially emotionally. Let's see, Leo. Ooh. I didn't expect to see this, especially in position one. This person's in love with you. The one that showed up as devil energy that you're letting go of, they in love with you. They love you deeply, genuinely. And for this to show up in position one shows me they are aware they love you deeply, that it's not some kind of crush that's going to fade away. This person loves you deeply. Yeah, they do. But they have a lot of secrets. They're very secretive. Um... There's a lot you don't know about them mm -hmm. and their past. Hmm. They're very scared of feeling such deep emotional connection with someone like they feel with you. It scares them not to be able to control their feelings and turn them off when they want to. They love you a lot. Two of Cups, finally. So this person realizes that they didn't make you feel love. They didn't show you appreciation when they should have, when they had you. This person and you had a serious relationship, whether it was marriage or engagement or planning to be married or living together. 
it, it was a serious relationship. This person cares for you deeply. It's just, they have skeletons in their closet. There's something going on here. Oh, you told them off. You sure did. You told them what time it is. You stood up for yourself. You cut them out of your life. You sure did. This is how they view you towards them. Very stern, guarded emotionally, telling them off, telling them goodbye, protecting your heart. Yeah. Universe, please show us. Obviously, they gave you reasons to be this way. Yeah. You, never, you wouldn't be this way unless... They gave you reasons. Universe, please show us. Huh. What's going on currently with that soulmate of Leo? And how's that soulmate of Leo towards Leo at this time? Especially emotionally. Justice. Wow. Karma. Wow. This person wants to fix what they did wrong. Yeah, they want to fix it. The reason for that is because they love you. If they didn't love you, they wouldn't care. They wouldn't think of you. They wouldn't miss you. They want, wouldn't want to fix anything. Yeah. Look how concerned they are. That you are single, available, attractive. Uh, you are a catch in relationships. And they see that now. They betrayed you in a major way. Here's betrayal. Whether they cheated on you or lied to you about something major or had you as a third party or had a third party behind your back. Whatever it was, was very serious. Yeah. They hide how they truly feel about you. They don't show it. They don't express it. Oh, my God. Yeah. So they realize why they lost you. They acted so immaturely. This is the worst page of all pages to describe a person. Someone who's in and out of your life, who doesn't express emotions, doesn't show love, doesn't communicate effectively, doesn't listen. They're spying on you. They want to know what's going on in your life, what you up to. This is a spycraft card more than any other. You don't know how badly they want to fix this situation to make it better. New soulmate popping up here for you again. So this new soulmate, you, you already either know or are about to meet. Either way, this soulmate is entering your life. I love King of Wands energy. This person is very concerned that you're going to be with somebody else because you are a kid, single, available, attractive. Yeah, look. This soulmate views you as marriage material. Yeah, they know they messed up. They regret it deeply. They know they lost you. They deeply regret losing you. It looks like you already know this soulmate, whether you're aware of the interest in you yet or not. This was a serious relationship for the for this person that wants to come back to you. Serious relationship, whether it was marriage or living situation or uh, engagement. This was a serious relationship, whether you were planning to be married. Hmm. It looks like some of you even have kids with that soulmate, family, household, right? Hmm. Serious universe, please show us what's going on currently with that soulmate of Leo that Leo's letting go of, and how's that soulmate of Leo towards Leo at this time, especially emotionally? Yeah, they betrayed you and you found out about it. So, you found out about it. Yeah, you did. You found out what they did. Yeah, they realized it wasn't worth losing you over. They realized that now. Yeah, this was a major betrayal. Mm -hmm. Look how scared they are. Scared that this is it, that you made up your mind. This shows me eight and one over here becomes nine of swords. Shows me that they feel enormous amount of guilt for losing you. They blame, blame themselves 100% for losing you. There's a lot going on around them from different people. So this person is concerned that there are people in your life who don't like them, who don't want to see them back in your life. Be careful who you trust, Leo, because you have people around you who gossip, who are dishonest, who love drama in other people's lives. Stay away from toxic people who are nosy, uh, who are chaotic. Yeah, stay away from toxic people. Yeah. This person that wants to come back to you wants to apologize to you and make amends with you, but they're so scared that you made up your mind already. Um, 
Leo, we're going to go into your extended reading. We're going to ask about this person, but also new soulmate entering your life that showed up as king of wands, one of my favorite kings. First, we're going to ask about this soulmate's true, genuine, long-term intentions and plans for you, however. What are they planning long-term? Then we're going to ask what they're currently hiding from you, whether purposely or can communicate for whatever reason, but the universe feels you need to be aware of for your highest good. And of course, at the end, we're going to ask advice for you on how to best handle the soulmate connection at this time and anything else you need to know about your life, including new soulmate entering your life, the king of wands energy, new chapters, new beginnings in your life, also your health, finances, business, job opportunities, family matters, friendships, whatever it is you need to know, they'll show it at the end of the reading as well. So Leo, click on the extended link below this video in the description box below, and I'll see you there. Love you guys.